Okay, this is exercise 1812, and I think the question was, I don't understand what they're asking me to do. Well, first off, they're giving you this background information, all that you see that's highlighted here. So you've got uh, some balance sheet information for two years, and then you've got some ratios. And the, I think the specific question was, I don't know what they're asking me to do. Well, you need to put in a dollar value in each of these four fields I'm highlighting. Uh, if I can highlight it correctly with this particular tool. Okay, now, one thing to keep in mind that a ratio, I think I can type this as I go, a ratio, the result is equal to a numerator divided by a denominator, right? Uh, if I can space this a little bit, it'll look, look a little cleaner, but I'm not sure I can. Uh, yeah, it doesn't want to. Let me click off of this a little bit and see. I can click back on. Yeah, it didn't want to, doesn't want to work that right because uh, it's not giving me the box around it. All right, so let me just keep furthering down here. So what that means is, let's say, is an example, you, had, you wanted to work gross profit, and gross profit would be equal, or excuse me, the gross profit percentage. Gross profit percentage would be equal to um, gross profit dollars, right, divided by net sales. Okay, so if that were the case, and they gave you the gross profit percentage, and let's assume it was, I don't know, I'll just make it up, make, make it 20%. So 20% would be equal to gross profit dollars divided by sales. Well, they haven't given you gross profit. Well, I, I am totally making this up. Let's assume they didn't give you gross profit, but they did give you sales of a million dollars. Okay, you should be able to use algebra and solve for gross profit, right? You're going to solve for that. Uh, well, let me highlight that. Yeah. Okay, and that's what's involved in this problem. Uh, they've given you various numbers and they've given you the solutions. So if you know what the ratio is, you can use algebra and, fa and solve for the unknown. That's what it's asking you to do here.